Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I am still attempting to go through my DMs and talk to more people who reached out to me for everything from crystal opening commentary submissions to questions to comments, to you name it. Uh, it's been quite the week, you know, the beginning of May is not generally something that I circle on my MCOC calendar for a bunch of submissions and things to talk about. Uh, obviously that usually is spring cleaning in April, but also July 4th weekend. And then you've got the summer spectacular, the summer camp sale, and then inevitably, of course, the cyber weekend offers and gifting. But May for this year only really, cause seven stars, you know, are only coming out once ha has been a month that's dominated a lot of conversation along with the first chance as a reminder in the side quest that we have to get a generic six star awakening gem from the threat level five exploration of uh, episodes one two three and four which remains shocking to me but there's a segue in here you see because as shocking as that six star generic awakening gem is what's even more shocking dare i say like Jaw to the floor surprising is the realization, and I've heard from three people who had this happen. Now, one of them, it was in regards to Paragon Crystals, and the other one, it was Seven Stars. But imagine, because everybody was opening up Crystals at the same time, that first hour that Crystals went live on Monday. So imagine... You're opening up a, say, seven-star crystal. And then the server crashes. And when you come back in your inventory, you look at your champions, and you have a new seven-star. Let's say you this is your first seven-star crystal. Let's say you got, for the sake of argument, this guy. Venom the Duck. Who I was fine with, but uh, some of the people who saw the live stream were... Not happy with and typing things like ew and ugh. I remember when he used to be such a hyped up champion. It's just the cosmic class is, I think, the top to bottom best class in the game now. And so Venom the Duck, compared to what he used to be in the cosmic class, is pretty dang average. But still, you know, I think he's a fun seven star to have. But let's say that Venom the Duck is your first seven star. And, uh, and so you had just purchased the crystal using the featured item 10,000 uh, seven star shards. But when you went there, you realized something crazy. You realized that the seven star shards were still there. Essentially, Kabam, because of the server issues, had given you a free seven star. And so, a couple of these summoners, again, I am not naming names for obvious reasons, went ahead and immediately ranked them up, and they have, up to the time of recording this, not heard back from Kabam. Because since this was their server error, some people just got to keep Paragon Crystals. Now, you might have seen, I opened 10 Paragon Crystals, and uh, five of those were Team Pop. It would not allow me to pop five of them, but when I refreshed the game... It still had the crystals as purchased. They just hadn't been opened yet, but it still deducted my units and it's still prepared for me to open them. So that part was pretty standard other than the annoyance of having to restart the game a couple times and ultimately having to open them one at a time because the server literally could not withstand the bandwidth, I guess. The hamsters were not able to keep track of five crystals at once. Now, uh, in fairness, that night I did pop some as a test and it worked okay. So. That issue has been resolved. Kabam doesn't want us to talk about this because they don't want people to know that they got a free 7-star. Now, I'm not making this video to have those people take that 7-star uh, away. No, no, no. But what I am saying is that when the servers crashed, you had two different kinds of summoners. You had people that, like, opened crystals, and even if the results counted, the points did not count for the 7-star celebration in either the individual or alliance points and so they were just screwed and then of course that's one extreme the other extreme is getting free paragon crystals or seven star crystals both happened 
It was like we were in the upside down, literally. So, some people got free seven stars. Some people got free Paragon Crystals. Some people got free anger, courtesy of Kabam's system not working. I've heard from both extremes. I'm not sharing any personal names to protect all parties involved, but the news has been confirmed, you'll just have to trust me on this, from images and even videos uh, privately. So I have seen firsthand what it's like to see somebody's account, purchase a seven star, open the seven star, have the result happen, and the crystal's still there, and so they get a bonus. That's pretty amazing, the ultimate W for those accounts, but everybody else is just sitting there being like, man, I wish that happened to me.